of titles, his third in a row. And he'll hope, in the process, to collect that £150,000 bet victor European. Trump's performances in these sort of events, not only here in Gibraltar, but the uh, European series, which he's, as you say, dominated. He treats every Turkish Open the first ever, so he's playing some good stuff. And it's taken a while this season to see him at his best, but I think he's nearing it now. I think he remains in this sort of event the man to beat, and that was before we saw. They have to win three rounds to get themselves into tomorrow's final day, where, of course, you've got to win a further four matches to be crowned champion. Andrew Higginson has his own motivation. So a win today would be like gold dust for Higginson. As Trump misses the long red by a margin. Foul. Hence the in off, and he's left one. But his long game has been a bit in and out this season. And that was one that didn't get very close. One. And Andrew Higgins won a professional title. He won on the old European tour back in 2011. Beat John Higgins in the final to win that. And of course, that remarkable run to the Welsh shows 5 1 down to Neil Robertson in the final. Then led 8 6, two up with three to play. But only scored seven Eight. more points in the last three off day. And the way that we've seen Ronnie O'Sullivan be a little below par, he is capable of taking advantage. Fourteen. Placed anyhow. The spot itself is free. But it was very much a different shot that he was playing on. Andrew Higgins. That pulled in. That did pull him. Two were surprised. Among those matches underway, the 12 times women's world champion Rianne Evans. Three. Barry 14. Pinches, whose son Luke has been playing this week in Gibraltar. He's playing Peter. Lord Milkins is 3 0 up on Lai Pei Fan. 21. So bags of matches ongoing. Of course, that'll remain the case until the field gets whittled down to just 16 for tomorrow. Seven frame events. Of course, you've got to win 28 frames. Full on, but enables you, I guess, to build momentum. And corner. Deciding not to. 34. Coming away from the reds a little bit. Where he's such a great shot maker, we can get the cue ball to Andrew Higginson, no doubt, reflecting on the red that he missed to the right centre, and then of course the fluked pink from one. Trump. Close to the red, but he couldn't pot it until he potted the red first, which he's done. Forty-nine. the cue ball right up the table. Worried right about leaving the red on here, so playing it a little bit casually. 71. Colour, and it should be 1 0 Trump. 64. Full work break from Trump. Trying to play the cannon here, which is over screwed. Know that there's 45 by so far. He's went back into the bottom right pocket, but uh, ultimately it's, it's the 69. Well, that sets the seal on this first frame. They take him in towards the red and the black. Not 
a couple of shots to, to sort of blow away the cobwebs, perhaps. The ready missed. Oh. went off, and then he was carrying on where he left off the final of the Turkish Open in, Tal in Natalia. Yes, I guess the groundwork for that title was laid at the Welsh Open, wasn't it, when he battled his way for this week as Andrew Higginson breaks off in frame two. Playing if he does miss it. One. Oh, beautiful kill. Showings this season a couple of round of 16s, the German Masters, where he lost to Fan Zheng Yi. I guess at the time it's... he would have seen that as something of a missed opportunity to get to a champion. And he also made the last 16 of the shootout. Yeah, an awful lot changed. European Masters he won. It was almost like you could see the improvement taking place before your very eyes. He played for an open to improvement. He's looked confident here, Higginson. I know that he near or at the top of his game. 24. Okay. Safety shot which swings the cue ball round the angles. If you miss the blue inside, it, you normally end up. Yeah, Evans, I should say. It was always behind the yellow, and it's nicely played again. One. It's one of those where he couldn't quite get himself to be high on the, the blue, but uh, finishing low. Player come back. That counts for everything in this game. There's a releasing pressure on him, but yes, prior to the Turkish Masters triumph, Trump's last ranking event, of course, came in the Gibraltar Open, albeit an extraordinary run of sustained success over the past two completed seasons. Eleven ranking titles in that time for him. He's got his eyes on the Crucible and crack at a second world title this spring. Get into the Tour Championship, given that he had a modest record in the ranking tournaments this season, but of course he's well and truly ensconced now. To, uh, to have any real hope. 29. And uh, in other words, to win an event like that, if he makes it, and he has now, £150,000 first prize. The rest of the season, although the early qualifiers for the World Championships remain at best of 11. 45. But if you are going to hit form into April, it's not a bad time, and that's, I think, where Judd is at with his game. That's good.
Yeah, that's nicely retrieved by Trump. So just this red, the process, leaving one on for Trump into the right center. And he looks like he's going to be heavily punished for it. 66. Thank you. This to make sure for Trump. Swiftly here. Barring snoopers, of course. I suspect this doesn't go in. Minutes. And he started well. 2 0 up against Andrew Higginson in this there 10th meet. The day yesterday was undoubtedly Kyron Wilson, who scored so heavily, made three centuries, could have had half a dozen if truth be told. He had a number of three, including 140 plus. But Wilson looking very sharp. Just put a nestle into these. There's a red sticking out. He doesn't want to hit hard that half ball. That's okay. That's if one turns up. Because it's going absolutely nowhere, this little exchange, to be honest. or prize money at all if you lose in the opening round but guaranteed 2,000 if you win your first match and then it goes up in 1,000 pound increments all the way to the semi-finals when well, they talk about matches the tournament's being top heavy and really this is the prime example of that isn't it I mean, what you say One. you see that ball go in and I don't know if he's got any to Q school in the summer so every match counts at this stage of the season just about room for Trump to get to the blue after knocking in the red, but not landing as he wanted to on a colour. Yeah, the, there was a ball's width, wasn't there? To see Trump playing with a smile on his face again. At times he looked quite fatigued, quite frustrated. It really did look like the best snooker he produced all season, really, bar perhaps the champion of champions. After Selt had pushed him hard in the first session and could easily have shared it. Leaving him a long pot, which of course he can't really refuse. Go in this. One made it well, almost too well to the point where has he taken any sort of a pop on? Andrew Higginson one. That'll do. Thank you. Yeah, it always looked as though the pink into the same one. intended it to. Not that he's ever been afraid of going in and out of balk to maintain a break. For my money, he's the best Six. in the choice. Alan, as mentioned, very much in the hunt for that Pet Victor bonus. Oh, but Trump's Trump. missed the red. Six. So he's making one of... It's a 
problem there, isn't it? When your opponent makes a mistake, they don't come around all that often. But you... I think there's the myth in this game is that however what? high ranked your opponent is, you play, you know, very rarely would you lose 4 0 and That's not get anything. What? One. Dwayne Jones is our latest winner. He's beaten Joe O'Connor 4 1. He'll now play Tom Ford, who beat Ian Burns earlier by the odd frame. We're up to Trump in this tournament last season. One of three finals he lost to Trump. required here. It's got to go. Oh dear, it's not Andrew reached. Higginson, five. Revs on it. One. Lead. Not in quite consummate form as we saw earlier. She was in his thoughts, trying to find it, and he has to have to play it again. It's going to get hard in behind it, though. Andrew Higginson, one. again to take it and the One. frustration for Higginson will be that he has had opportunities I mean I just didn't see what was in it for him playing it he probably didn't know what else to do but Sir. he's leaving the other red playing it almost Anyway, Seven. at least for him. Big shot this. One. Yeah, well done. So now all of a sudden. So. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. One. I was going to say he might have been able to work out. I've been his friend so far today. Trump has made a number of errors in this. This goes in, and he gets behind the yellow. It's surely 3-0. John played well in the first two. This frame... Nine. Well, look, he's not been quite the same, actually. 3-0, anyhow, that's all that really counts. Doesn't matter how. Twelve. He's had chances, but... Trump... Nonetheless, in complete control now. 16. Just one frame. Screwed that in with right hand size. So didn't expect the cue would have come back at that angle. Yeah, it's one way traffic so far speed. this match, isn't it? And the Three down with four to play. There's always hope, but for Andrew Higginson, the problem has been not getting chances. He's had plenty. It's making something substantial from them, and clearly that now has to change fairly dramatically. He's to have any chance from here. Trump just won in a somewhat precarious position. And race to stay on the tour.
a bit big upon a double. on the table that he can keep the ball safe over there on the left cushion Not well, to where they started Most to be seen. So the fact that he didn't quite get under the cushion with the cue ball means that Judd was able to play that shot and walk over with Anthony Hamilton withdrawing from the event. What, what's going to give first here is Judd. It's a possible way of getting something started. He's playing it. He's playing it. Just brilliant. Now he wishes he didn't get the cue ball side of it quite right. So that, goodness me. That was, uh... That cutback black was, and yes, OK, he's 3-0 up. He's got some Nine. wiggle room, but even so, terrific queuing from Trump, and it might just be a match winner. Well, this is where he's always been so good. I just don't think there were that many better. He just maybe something out of absolutely nothing well. here. And now, all those reds that we said were in open play are you know, his mercy. Just get the sense that there's a slight change in Trump's demeanor with that victory in Turkey. By his standards, gone quite a long time between ranking successes, the ability to win in second gear. We've seen the likes of Mark Selby, John Higgins do that down the come with winning again, getting back into the winner's enclosure, lifting another major trophy. An outstanding record in this tournament. Very happy memories of playing in it. Not to be sniffed at the incentive of another six-figure check. Million on the table this season with that triumph in Antalya. Little season when he won the world title. 34. Like this, it? it wouldn't amount to as many as you'd think. I mean, he's been putting a lot of balls here and he's made... And while he's there, there's not a lot that uh, Higginson can do. 38. We're actually going to get a little... That would open up things at this end of the table as well, where he's not really been in this break. Seems to two, so Wilson will play Rob Milkins in round two. Oh, cushion there, it might do. Yeah, well, that's the aim. Forty-nine. Terrific queuing. Well, absolutely right, Philip. It's uh, been a, they've become very difficult. Forget that the opening 52. red was a cross double. Must be tight this. Half a pocket. Half if he ends up making it with all the low value colours, he has been spending a lot of time at the other end of the table. The way he's fashion this break out of very little. Jetram, 62. He's missed that. One. So, Andrew Higginson trying to get the 25 minutes time, half past three local time, that's half two UK time. 
Bus will bring you live Bye. here on table one. Round two match. That's assuming, of course, something truly remarkable doesn't take place here. Higginson somehow getting back into this frame. Missing the black, that's not going to happen.